<clears throat> Hello and welcome. My name is Geo from SwitchRPG.com. We are playing Griffland today. In the previous episode, we did one of three quests for fish in the Dragon Dog. Please, if you haven't already, make sure you watch that first episode so you can kind of understand what's going on. There is a, quite a bit about this game in terms of uh, in terms of how to play it and, and its mechanics. So here we are doing our second of the three quests we're going to check out i guess we can get different outfits i i was just looking at the grog and dog you can go to your room and change different outfits i'm wondering if this is maybe something here or if this is kind of of a merchant type of shop i don't know what i do want to know is if you can look at a quest log so i'm going to push the plus menu here no there isn't all right i also healed up I was around, I think I needed like 15 health or so. So I did heal up and I did that by eating some sort of a fish sandwich in there. Uh, we're going to go to clearing here. This is one of the deck collection that we need to do for fish. So let's take a look. Ah, random encounter. Cool, cool, cool. As you're passing by a bubbling tar pit, you hear a high-pitched whine from somewhere nearby. Looking around, you spot a coyote pup. Struggling in the clotted black mud. Alright. Untrained pets help you in battle, but I only have a minor effect in negotiations. Lose 12 HP. Do I try to rescue this thing? I do. I'm coming to get you, buddy. Don't be scared. Oh, boy. You anchor yourself to a nearby stump before stepping in carefully into the tar. Freeing the pup is a labor, is a, is a labor and you choke down the sour air of the tar pit under, it, under the exertion. And I lose 12 HP. Way to freaking go. Back on dry land, the pup finds a clean patch of skin above your brow to lick the, with its scratchy tongue. Of course I'm going to save the dog, right? Ugh. The pup cocks its head in concern. Nah, it's fine. Maybe just keep it to yourself next time. Oh boy, don't piss him off. Yeah, you're coming with me. Unless you'd prefer to stay here in the tar pits. Nah. That's what I thought. All right, we got a party member. Cool. And it's a little doggo. Yep, we're going here. Let's keep going. All right. Clove, what do you got? Whoa. What brings you back? Well, uh, a quest, actually. Shakape. Where does you got work for me? I'm happy to help if the price is right. Hmm. I lent Vis 123 shills and he's past due in paying me back. Do you want to see if you can go collect on it? No problem. What do you want me to do if they don't have it though? Make an example out of them so folks don't start thinking I'm a charitable operation. Either way, I'll see you get paid because I know you're no charity yourself. Alright, cool. We got 60 shells for reward. Pick a card to help on the quest. And we also get Hip Flask. Okay. So here's our card to add. The damage of the next card played on the, is doubled. That's the negotiation. Gain two counter for each card played this turn. Gain two defense and apply impair. That's also pretty cool. I do like Evil Eye. In the first episode, we played a... I, I tried for the battle tactics. I think we do need to start diving into negotiation. Uh, they just offer different dialogue choices um, and, and different paths. So, this is pretty good. Let's try that. We're going to go, drop this one here. Good luck. You probably need it out there. Yeah, probably. All right, where are we going? Let's go travel. There's a Grogan dog. It looks like we're heading all the way up here. Let's go. Oh, 
What's going on here? So we've got a guard here. Yip it. Proprietor. And I think that's the dude. That's the guy, right? Okay, so let's talk to the guard. Rumor has it Nand has been thinking about running for leadership. It's unfortunate that he doesn't live in a democracy. This is Nand. All right. Didn't think my day would involve a grifter dealing. I pay Nand to help you so I can help. Huh. Okay. Do I do that? I only got 45. Nah. I'm not doing it. What do you got, bro? Give it. A hard time is taking a soul on Yibit, but Yibit doesn't seem to mind. Yibit nods an acknowledgement of your presence. Well, it's a start. So I can pay him to look the other way. Yibit will stay out in any negotiation or battle payoff. Okay. Is this guy going to be an issue? Sure. Can We're I getting money, right? Might be a bit trouble coming. You're not going to fear, are you? Casalosha. You do what you want. I won't try and stop you. Okay. So you've been paid off. What about you, bro? What's going on with you? As with most admiralty, Lasco is only hard on crime that doesn't pay. Shukukua. All right. 45 shills. Oh, my gosh. So if I pay you, the other dude won't be a problem in a negotiation battle, I'm guessing. We'll try it. Sakikasa. Okay, well, maybe we'll just have the guard and this dude to deal with. We just don't have the... the no, well, how much was this one? Oh, uh, we've lost it. And it's 45. Either way, we could not afford it. The life expectancy of the average laborer in Havaria isn't long, and this looks twice that old. The Jerackle looks you up and down in suspicion. Confront him about his debt. You know Clove. She hired me to collect. Personally, I'd like this to go easy, but I'll leave it up to you. Yeah? Well, I'll make this easy on you. As easy on you as I can. I ain't got it, and Clove sending hired goons to breathe down my neck won't change it. Offer to pay... Offer to pay the debt off for them. I don't have that. Oh, that kind of, that kind of sucks, right? I just <laughs> I just spent a bunch of money, although it wasn't this much. I don't think I would not have had that money. Yeah, I can't. I gotta roughen them up. That sucks. I kind of want to do negotiation. Dude, you are in. Tr you're in trouble. Big trouble. Oh man, I feel so bad for this guy. <laughs> oh, I won't do the dirty work. My other guys are. That's it. Oh wait, I do. I have playable cards. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Zero, zero, uh, actions. Ah, mud in your brains. Alright, now that's our turn. Alright, this is one we just got, right? Gain two defense, discard this. Gain two defense and a counter. Oh, he's a wounded elbow to the face. And that's going to be it. Yeah, this guy just not have... I'm not going to kill him. No. That just That guy just stood no chance. Apply four bleed, discard two cards, attack a random enemy for two damage. Whenever this card is improvised, it gains two damage. All right, we're going to go condition card. Lacerate. Zobutu. Clove sends her regards. You've done what you've done, 
you've come to do. Run off to your master and tell her the job's done already. Oh man. Leaving you to enjoy. It looks like I'm I'm kind of going at this kind of a kind of a DB, right? Oh, I feel, I feel bad. <laughs> All right, so let's uh Oh, that's not it. I guess we've done our deed. I thought I'd have to turn the quest in. Let's go see what this trustee's outfitting is. You didn't get the money, but at least you scared the Ashnu Dung, the Ashnu Dung, out of this. All right, so that is kind of where we need to go. And there he is. Sepuka. Greetings once again. Tell tell him what happened to this. This didn't have the shields, but I made sure to pass on your uh, message. Yeah, I figured as much. I bled him pretty dry already. Wish I could have been there to see it, but I'm kind of a busy person. Your payment, as promised. Thanks for the job. What did we get paid? 60 shields. We're still broke. Quest bonus, hip flask. Alright. Cool. Gain one influence. Yes, we kind of need a gift. No, 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 no. We're not giving anybody money. But it looks like maybe we can get something here. Cash nom de gras is more important, more aspirational than accurate. I'd ask you what you're lurking through the feud. I'm sorry. I'd ask you what you're up to lurking through the feud at, at night. But then you might ask me the same. Okay, card drop. Healing vapors. Oh, wow. Apply six mending, replenish, destroy after one use. Has 50% chance to stun the targets. Summons a combat drone. That's pretty cool. I do like the healing. I have no healing ability, so this would be the one. I'm going to buy this. Yeah. Cool. All right, I don't know who you are. Um, let's go travel. Oh, it's night times. What are these things, my bobs? Huh. Again, everything's kind of randomized, so we're doing okay so far in this run. Let's go see what this is. Oh, boy, opportunity here. Looks like the remains of a recent skirmish. Perhaps there's still something to loot. Take a look. Oh boy. Oh boy. You come across the signs of a recent battle. If there's any winners, they weren't the type to loot the battlefield. All right. The bodies are still fresh. Best to grab something and run before any beasts are drawn bloodshed. All right. I can do this quickly. Take some time. This will make you vulnerable. Search so crates for a combat drone. Let's just do this quickly. Leave. All right, we got something. I mean, that's good, right? Looks like this is our next thing. Like, I can't go anywhere else. I I need a yeah. I need an actual marker. All right, let's go here. All right, I don't have to pick, but. Fish greets you with, or greets you enthusiastically. Sal, I've lined up a great opportunity for you. Those two over there are night merchants. They sell rare goods you can get nowhere else, and it just so happens they need your help. You can only be in one place at a time, but either will get you a leg up you sorely need, kid. Go tell them I sent you and then ingratiate yourself. Just be warned that they're both persnickities and persnickety so-and-sos. You're probably going to get cheese off one you don't pick. Okay. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, add. not one of them is not gonna like me. Oh well. All right, sounds great. All right. Block of the, the swab or endo. Right, I like this guy. He looks like a pirate. Blocker keeps her purse strings tight, but she's known to favor a friend in need. 
Evening, Grifter. Ask about the special job. Okay. Fish says you're looking for some hired muscle. Plaka the Swab looks you up and down. You feel like an Ashnu on market day. Yes, you'll do. Wait, do for what? What's the actual job? You just need to stand behind me and look intimidating. You can handle that, right? Depends. What's standing in front of you? Don't worry about that part. You do this job and I'll let you into the night market. Alright. But Endo, the other dude, will dislike me. I don't care. The details are fuzzy, but I'm in. Excellent. Let's go. I'll lead the way. Alright. Hesh does not forget, Grifter. And neither will I. I mean, it's it's no, like, disrespect. It was one or the other. Alright, where are we going? I could have healed. I probably should have healed, actually. We're going to a rug's room. This is a simple task. Simple, simple task. Plaka Swab opens the door to a nondescript hovel and ushers you through. Say nothing, Sal, until I tell you to say something. I was just looking for you. The graft you sold me, it stopped working. The graft I so graciously extended credit for you to buy? I disabled it when you fell behind your payments. Again. I could pay. I have the money. It's too late for that. I'm losing money just taking the time to talk to you. I'm going to need the graft back. But it's it's installed. They don't just come out unless you unless you cut them out. You can't make me do that, please. I wouldn't dream of asking you to do that to yourself. Which is why I brought my friend here. Sal, extract the graft from Orug, if you please. Oh man, do it. Extract the graft. <coughs> Excuse me. Back for business. You know what? It's, what? it's what you wanted me to do. I'm a bounty hunter. That's my. It's kind of my thing. I'm sorry, but this is my job. Try not to move. I'll make this as painless as possible. You monster. Oh boy. It takes a while, but you eventually find it and take it out. The last biomechanical tendrils pull out with a sickening pop. Orug survives the process. Barely. I won't forget this. Good job, Sal. I was worried for a moment that you might have a conscious. Uh, here, take it. Oh, no. I got a bane? Oh, jeez. I didn't know this was the thing. Opponents start with an additional argument in each negotiation. That sucks. Dang it. Take shuffle step. Which is what? It's one it's a graft, but what is it? Show a shot. Ah that, that tingles. Sukonasu. Ah, you could have at least washed it off first. I probably should have done that. Now, as promised, I'll show you the way to the market. Alright, this is that's the market. That's the Gragon Dog. Let's go. This is it, huh? Pretty modest. Pretty modest. People don't come here for the ambiance. They come here for the goods. They can't get anywhere else. Block of the Swab now likes you and will offer you discounts on our shop. Okay, she's left the party. We got a vendor here. She's also a vendor. She offers me discounts, but I only have five chills, so I don't have much. Let's see what she's got. Black of the Swab, I'll just call her the Swab, is tuning up for one of her black market graphs. I keep telling you these graphs are made for someone of your talents. Add more graph slots. All right, let's take a look at some some of these here oh 
I ain't got no money. I ain't got enough. All right, let's get out of here. What do I have for grafts? I do want to know what that... What is this? What? Oh, okay. It's my party. I was like, what is that? Like, you just see, like, a little thing sticking out here. Uh, da -da 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 -da. No, 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 no. Oh, there's the graphs right there. Shuffles up. Whenever you improvise, you gain a maneuver card. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. I, obviously, I can't afford anything. I only have five, five shills. But we do have another quest here. Take a quick peek. It's late when you get back to the Grog and Dog, but you can spot trouble before you even step onto it onto its porch. You slip quietly behind an overturned table before anyone notices. So I hear you've been asking after my bounty, but you're out of the game, fish, so you must be asking for someone else. I don't hold it against you, but whatever hunter you're hiding, you need to hand them over. There's no hunter here, Cassio, but we both know that that won't stop you from being a mudsucker. I have a business to run, same as you. There was a time when you respected that. That slimy underside of Cassio's voice is enough to draw you out from your hiding spot, Blade at the ready. Don't be so smug, Cassio. Nobody gets a bounty like yours without enemies. Sal, you're the hunter? I thought you'd have... I'd have thought that Derek would have been beating the spirit out of you. I didn't have... It didn't have to be this way, Cassio. You could have bought me out at any time. I'd have, I'd have forgiven you. With that look in your eye? I don't think so. Don't mistake this conden condensation. I'm sorry. Don't mistake this for condensation. I'm proud you have made it off the Derek. I should have known you would. Excuse me, if you don't mind, if you don't stick around to see this done, it'll hurt too much to see you go down. Cassio tosses a fistful of shills onto the soiled bar counter. For the damages, fish, if you manage to survive, it ain't nothing personal after all. Not even the floorboards creak as Cassio leaves. For a moment, her goons hang there, hang there watching to see what you'll do go down quiet hunter i promise it'll be just like going to sleep i can attack i do have a party member opponent has plus 10 resolve attack let's go dude whoa you cannot run. All right. You know what? Let's try it. Let's try it. Plus 10 resolve sounds like a big deal. So you have no idea what she signed you up for. All right. Well, here we go. We do have some help. This guy's got 100 health. I'm going to take a drink. And let's do this. This is a big boss. Big boss. Might be a bad idea. Let's start applying some defense here. Bleed is uh, it's going to be helpful, I think. It's kind of like an extra, like extra attack. Let's go here. Gain one power. Apply one impair. Okay, we're going to do that. Let's go for it. we got applying conditions on them. Alright, I'm, I'm going to apply defense every single chance I have. Six mending. It's a big deal. That is a big deal. Let's also do this. We're going to want to apply conditions, and that is going to be it. All right, and turn. That's right, bro. That is right. 
spark grenade. Oh man, my friend is not doing so good. Removes a random... Oh, he's giving up. Oh, that's not good. Don't give up now, my friend. Let's get him. And we're done. And he's bleeding. Nice. I should have done this first, to be honest with you, because I would have had an extra two cards. Uh, but let's go with here. And we're good. 39 health. We're doing all right. Uh, four defense. Let's give it to you. Can I give you another four? Oh, it does stack. Okay, that's good to know. Good to know. We're going to do this and apply random... Uh, attack one random enemy. Apply a wound. And that's it. Yeah, that's it. Oh, he's countering now. He's charging. Dang. Wow. That was a big that was a big deal. He's almost done though. He's almost done. Whoa. Okay, I need to I need to heal. It's like the only chance I have there. Please, no more. Dude, you're done. Execute. Execute. Yeah, dog. Oh, I can. Oh, all right. It's cool. Cool, cool. 21 shields. That is like nothing. Sparky's oppressor cell. Oh, wait, I get all this stuff? Oh, pick the loot you want to keep. I want all of it. All right, let's do this. If this card was improvised this turn, attack three times. Oh, wow, nice. Draw a card, it costs zero until it's played. Whenever you apply bleed, heal one. Hmm. I do like this, though. That's what we're going for. We're going to do that one. Oh, I got all this stuff. This is even better. All right, gain one action every three cards in your discard pile. Second win. All right. At the beginning of your turn, gain one dominance. Whenever you destroy an argument, gain an action. Hmm. I, again, I, I've been doing a lot more of the battle stuff. I've really got to get familiar with some of this. Uh, at the beginning of your turn, gain one dominance. We're going to go here. All right, we got a battle upgrade. Wait, what was that? I just... Oh, shoot. I don't know. I don't know if that went through. I have no idea. I, I hit back. New battle card. Sparky's Oppressor Cell. Gain 21 shields. All right, you're starting to get a reputation for violence. Yeah, that's not not good, right? Known thug. 
pick a grafter reward. All right. Boss negotiation stuff. At start of your turn, reduce the cost of a random card in your hand by one until played. Gain one action at the start of your turn. When installed, two random people would hate you. Gain one action at the start of your turn. All hostility cards deal 50% less damage. I like this one. We'll try that. Install it. Or I could take monies. You know what? Let's take the money. Press B. Take 100 shills instead. We could use that money. Fish carefully navigates the mess of her bar, favoring her side. She doesn't look too badly injured, but she's not as young as she used to be. Well, that shucked a rotten oyster. But we've been through worse, and we're still standing. I can't believe she came for you like that. You. She doesn't even. She doesn't care about anyone, does she? She's just a monster all the way down. What's done is done. The fire's only good if it stokes the engine, kid. I should have gone for Cassio as soon as she arrived. I should have gone for Cassio as soon as she arrived. Now you're dragged into it. None of that. You've got a bit of grit in your eye. You'll wink it out once you get some sleep. I've got a room set up for you in the back. With Cashew gone, the few patrons that remain return to their drinks. Them that weren't spilled, anyway. Alright. I guess she's got a room for us. There's one of the cakes she's got for us rest in the back the good night's rest can hurt unless I wake up dead that is Cassio won't come back on my watch the back's barricaded and the front has me good night kid fish leads you through a curtain behind the bar nodding towards the cozy room at the back room rook unlocked You've unlocked a new character with a whole new story and location with unique cards and gameplay. Give it a try when starting a new run. Playing Rook doesn't delete your progress with Sal. Your bed calls you. That night you dream you're a kid again with the mud up to your armpits and your friend Prindo is laughing at you. Nice. Hmm. <laughs> we got some some hate. All right. So sleep restoration rate is fifty two percent. We've got that. We got our resolve. We got some new likes, which is good. New hated. Just these are just dislikes. We got hated. This guy freaking hates us. We ripped. We ripped that thing right out of there. All uh, right. So this is the battle graph we got. We got some new cards. What did this? What did this one do? I didn't get to see this. Gain three temporary power. Alright. This is kind of cool. This is what we got from our... our uh, defeating the, the boss. Alright. We all knew this stuff. Known thug. Deal one resolve damage to a random opponent argument whenever you draw this card. Costs nothing, I guess? Hip flask. Gain one influence. Destroy after three uses. Evil Eye. The damage of this next card played this turn is doubled. Some of these have upgrades, right? What am I? What was I looking at? Um, I thought I was looking at something that said, "Oh, preview upgrades." Nice. All right. We're not going to get too far into those right now. Uh, but that's going to do it for today's episode. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Uh, but before that, you slept through the night with one hand gripping the knife under your pillow. But then you've slept that way every single night since you were 12. All right. Let, I'm sorry. Let's just get through this. I don't want to leave you guys 
hanging too much. All right, it's early morning, but Grog and Dog's patrons are already hard at work on their drinks. So, I thought I should hold off on that bounty, but after last night, if Cassio wants me to be your worst nightmare, I'd like to oblige. And how are you going to do that? She knows you're here, and she's got the money and the goons to keep her safe. What do you got? Uh, you? You're damn right. Lucky for you, I have a couple of contacts who want Cashew dead as almost as much as you do, if you can convince them to work for you. Will they need convincing? Afraid so. Admiralty doesn't trust hunters as a rule, but talk to my contact and see if you can convince her otherwise. But taking out Cashew would make a space for the for the spreed be more than happy to fill. I know somebody who who will talk to you, especially if you can bring him to ca Cashier's head on the platter. Alright, let's head out. We're going to head out to those contacts in the next episode. So be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.